Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. So today's video is going to be a Topshop haul, as you will have seen from the title. So this is all stuff that I bought from Topshop recently and all links will be in the description box below. There's a few sort of going into springy summery pieces and a few that are probably still suitable for the current weather we have. It has just been snowing. Uh, so that's a bit weird but yeah since I'm stuck in I'm doing a lot of online shopping so if you'd like to see more hauls please give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any in the future but without further rambling let's get on with the haul so the first thing I just went to hold up to show you but I'm actually wearing it so it is this green top with little puffy shoulders and quite a wide sort of round neck it's got long sleeves you'll see much better in the try on which I'll overlay but yeah unfortunately I can't show you this one because I have got it on which was silly didn't really think about that one it is a cropped length as well so today I'm wearing it with high-waisted culottes and it's just a really really good length with them I think so yes I really like this top it's like a stretchy ribbed material if you can see that a bit closer up I absolutely love the colour so I think this will be a really good bright piece to add to my wardrobe going into the spring because I thought this top would be such a good staple in my wardrobe I also picked it up in black because black is just one of those colours that you just always need, I find. A black top, can't go wrong. Again, wide neck, puffy shoulders and long sleeves. Exactly the same, same rib material. And yeah, I just think this is absolutely classic. I think it would look so cute with like a light blue pair of mom jeans. It did come in white as well and I was very tempted. However, I did see, is it Susie from Hello October? Did a haul and she had the white one and um, she did say it was a little bit see-through so I gave it a miss this time but I do really like it so if I wear these non-stop then I might consider picking up the white one but yeah just absolute staples and I know I'm gonna love them. Next we have a pair of trousers and you'll have to forgive me if you notice any dirty patches I have actually worn these and I've just fished them out the washing basket which is kind of gross but it's fine they shouldn't have to be visibly dirty um so they are these ribbed wide leg trousers which I thought would never suit me but actually I really like them I think in the clip I tried them on with bed socks so excuse that they would actually look really cute with like a pair of white trainers they are quite a thick material and a thick rib which I really like because it makes them really warm and really cozy they've got a nice stretchy waistband and yeah that's pretty much all I can say about them they are a good length for me I maybe would have liked them a couple of centimeters longer there's no hem so you can't let the hem down or anything um, but yeah they just cut off at the right point I think and they're nice and high waisted so yeah I really enjoy these they're a new look for me not worn anything like this before bit different to leggings and jeans and I think you can really dress them down with just a t-shirt or a crop top or dress them up with something like this for example and a nice pair of shoes so yeah I really like those and they're something a bit different for me next up we have a more summery piece so this is a dress it's a white summer dress it's got that sheared material at the top and it's got nice puffy sleeves we are loving a puffy sleeve recently as you can tell but yeah it's got little puffy sleeves which cut at a really nice length actually they're quite long and um, they come in at the bottom but they're not too tight on me I got everything in a UK size 12 by the way apart from one of the items which is a 14 but I'll show you that in a little while but yeah I actually really like this I think it's really flattering it's sheared to the waist and then it kind of flares out it has got a slit up the side which again really flattering on the leg it's like a nice midi length on me I'm five foot eight so I am quite tall but yeah I just really like this and I think a white dress is such a staple just throw it on all you really need is a pair of nude underwear and you're good to go I'm trying it on with white knickers and you can definitely see them so hopefully it's not too noticeable but yeah definitely a pair of nude undies and you're good to go I think it'd be such a staple coming into summer just to throw on with a little tan belt maybe some tan heels and one of the other items that I have to show you which I will show you next so yes the item I thought would look really cute with the white dress is this little wicker bag I have wanted like a wicker bag for so long and I think this is just the perfect size because it's not too much and it's got this cute little shell clasp on it it did come in like this kind of color with the straps and the white I went for the white because I thought it would go with more but obviously I'm a fan of this color so I think it would also be really cute 
but it just opens, opens forward like that and it's actually a decent size, you know, you could get definitely your phone, you could get your lipstick in there and it's just a nice cute little fun bag for a little barbecue or to take on holiday with you, it's just a shoulder bag. I just really liked it and I think it's well made, I don't know how how durable it'll be but yeah I really like it, I think it's a cute fashion piece. So next I thought I'd break it up a bit and do some jewellery. So the first earrings I have are incomplete because I actually have a couple of them in. Um, so I've got the bigger hoops and one of the smaller hoops in my second hole. You'll see these in the close-up clip. And these are the Freedom Fine Air Jewellery, which I've never tried before, but I really like those. And just from their normal Freedom range, I actually picked up some hoops. I thought they were, I'm going to put them in front of my face just so they focus, but I thought they were going to be a lot smaller, but they are quite large, but I actually really like them. I am shocked at myself because a lot of gold hoops, I think, they can look a bit cheap, but no, these don't they definitely look really cute and I can't wait to wear these going into the summer with the white dress really cute white dress loads of gold jewelry really really cute so yeah there are those bigger earrings I also bought some necklaces and they're a trio of necklaces you can wear them together or you can wear them separately I'm just wearing the longer one today because I also have the hoops and didn't want it to be too much but yeah I really like those you'll see them in the close-up I'm not gonna try and show you now because I'll get all tangled but yeah I just picked up some jewellery and I really like all of it. The next thing I have to show you is again a bit different for me but you know what? I absolutely love it. I absolutely love it. It is this blazer in like a, oh, what do you call it? Like an ecru kind of colour. I think they call it ecru. I'm not sure guys. I'm very bad with colours but it is quite an oversized. I got it in my usual size which is a 12. It's got tortoiseshell buttons. I think it sits really nicely and I think the reason it suits me more than other blazers is because it's not too structured. It's more of a throw on. The sun's come out so apologies if the lighting goes a bit odd. But yeah it's more of like a throw on over piece rather than a structured blazer so I do think it suits me a lot better. It's got the sleeves rolled up and I absolutely love it this way. That's probably how I would wear it and I just think over you know a top like this and jeans it would just make it look a bit different and just break it up a little bit or over like a little dress I think it could be really really cute so I'm definitely over the moon that I picked this up especially when there was 30% off because I think it was quite pricey but yeah can't be a bargain and I think I'll wear this a lot going into the summer and you know for summer evenings on holiday and that I think it'd be absolutely perfect so I'm very glad I picked this up and the last thing we have is something that has been an absolute staple in my wardrobe for many many years and that is a black leather jacket now obviously not this one because I've just picked it up but I've had a black leather jacket in my wardrobe since Probably I was about 13 or 14 and I just can't live without one. So my current one's looking a bit tatty. It's a bit small for me on the shoulders. I just need a little bit more room in it. So I picked this up in a size 14 which is sizing up for me and it is gorgeous. It's real leather so again I got it when there was money off and it was I think a reasonable price. So originally it was 169 I got it for 135 I need to try this on a lot more to decide if I'm going to keep it. And I'm still unsure whether I should have got the 12 to be honest, because it is quite oversized. And I like my leather jackets to be quite cropped, so I can wear them with dresses and things. But either way, this is a beautiful quality leather jacket. I just really like it. I like the pockets as well. So I'm going to try it on with a few more outfits, really decide whether it's the right fit for me, it's the right size for me, it's the right style and yeah, we'll see. I suppose I'll update you in a vlog whether I decide to keep it but I do absolutely love it whether I keep it or not. It's an absolute quality piece and I love the look of it. And that boys and girls is everything I picked up from Topshop when they had 30% off. Let me know in the comments down below what was your favourite piece and whether you're planning on doing any online shopping anytime soon. I really hope you did did enjoy seeing new pieces that I picked up for my wardrobe and like I said at the start please give it a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it because it just lets me know what kind of content you're enjoying and what kind of content I can make more of in the future. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Bye!